Hi, this is Anthony to inform you about the Amazon Associate program Add Unit Migration. If you are an Amazon Associate, you would have received an email notification. Essentially, Amazon is making improvements to their technology platform, and this will require associates to replace some older product links, banners, and widgets. These changes are effective August 1st, 2015, so you will have to ensure that you replace any affected links by July 31st, 2015. On the email, you will see this link, and if uh, if you click on it, it's going to take you to the Amazon Associate dashboard. Just make sure you're logged in. You will find instructions on what you need to do. Essentially, you will need to replace uh, two links, and one of them is this one right here, ws.amazon.com. Uh, you have to replace that one with uh, ws-na.amazon-adsystem.com, and the second one's right there. So on that same page, uh, you will see a summary uh, of the number of pages and add units uh, that are affected. And if you scroll down, uh, you will see a list of the websites that you need to uh, that need to be updated. And I'm going to be using this one as an example. So you essentially um, click on that link, and it'll take you where the add unit needs to be updated. So this, in my case, uh, this is the one that uh, needs to be updated. It's a widget, and um, you basically go back to the dashboard once you click that link, and then click on this Add Code to Change button, and that's going to show you um, the code that needs to be changed. And uh, if you go back to, to your website and go to the you know Edit mode. And in the HTML section, of course, this is going to be de uh, it's going to depend on what platform you're using. It could be WordPress. This is Blogger that I'm using. Uh, so as you can see, this is the code right here that needs to be um, changed. Of course, not not everything. But what you can do is um, you can use the Control F. That is Control um, F is basically a find and replace feature, and uh, look for exactly that. Um, that URL. So in my case, there are three instances that I need to change that for this specific uh, specific code. So I basically need to change that um, those three instances. And uh, in this case, as I said, ws.amazon.com will re be replaced with ws-na.amazon-adsystem.com. So I basically change all the three instances and then just update it. Um, uh, so you know it's it's ready to go and then you can go back just to make sure that the uh, ad unit is still displaying okay which in my case it is and then if you go back to the dashboard and click the refresh button you will notice that uh, it has now been reflected with the uh, updated code as you can see it says we cannot uh, we could not find any code that needed to be updated so that's pretty much taken care of. You can then click this uh, next button and you know use the same process for all the other ones that need to be updated. So that's pretty much you know uh, what what it is. You can find an FAQ section um, on the add unit migration, and um, uh, just make sure that you know you update your affected um, add units by July thirty first, twenty fifteen. And um, if you've got any questions, you know, you can feel free to leave them in the comment section. And you can check my uh, YouTube channel for more tutorials on uh, the Amazon Associate um, program. Thanks for stopping by.